Ready, go ahead. Okay, just working with a couple 2010 AAA players. Uh, we're working on our shots, so we're getting the velocity here so we can get our averages and our starting points. Right, lots to work on in this video. We'll continue to polish up all these little techniques, work on the puck position where we're pulling it from the blade. But it's very important that you understand what we gotta fix here. 73. Six. Six. 70. 71. So as we talked about on the ice, uh, you're going to see in your repetitions that you're doing a very inefficient mechanic where it's very difficult to handle the puck, right? You're hitting that outside edge, right? I want you guys to instill this hip flip mechanic whenever you're opening up to the puck because it gives you multiple options and gives me the ability to change direction while in this stance. All right, this is the definition of happy feet. Multiple crossovers that aren't powerful. It gets our posture upright and it doesn't give us the ability to catch pucks with consistency. All right, there's two pretty solid reps. You can see coming out of it, trying to make passes off crossovers don't work. All right, I think this one's just a bad bounce. All right, but this right here is pretty solid technique. Opening up, one cross under, open the hips. All right, that's what you want to do when you open to the puck. All right, toe drag release. We're using the anchor to get into this position. Eyeballs up, that back foot's not grinding, and then we're getting into a nice compression zone. Please, go ahead. Two more. Okay, so the hip flip shave mechanic, two foot stance, I'm on inside edges, hands are out. I receive it as I flip, do the shave mechanic head is over that shoulder. You're gonna watch in your repetitions that we're doing this double set mechanic and our eyeballs are scanning down the entire time. Okay, one timer technique, my front arm straight, and then I get it back to 90 degrees and fully rotate my hips towards the net. And that's how I generated all that power.